What's good with y'all? What's good? What's good? What's good? What's good? We tuning in for another video, man. Y'all see the thumbnail? Y'all didn't even know it, it was cracking. I told y'all in the other in the other vlog, I had went to Summit a few days few day back. Me and wife, I got the shots, car loads, and all this stuff for the don't. So, man, we finna see see what that thing hit like, man. I went ahead and put the feet on it. Uh, I'm gonna ride it like it is right now. But y'all see it in the thumbnail, but y'all gotta see it up close and personal, man. So, call be done today. Uh, soon as Jesse give me that call, I'm shooting over there to see it. I also put a brand new carburetor on it. Uh, so we got a Holly 600 on it instead of that Quadzet. And they went ahead and put the hood release cable on for me and everything since they was at it. Uh, I was gonna do that, but they went ahead and knocked that out. So we finna be dead in the game, man. So. Well, y'all know when we we'll get it back to the house, man, I'm gonna take the pictures of all that good stuff and everything, and then show you the carburetor on there, the little spring setup and all that I got. So, yeah, man, y'all stay tuned. All right, y'all. Y'all see it? Mount it up. Clean, boy. Pick this thing up, man. We had a late, late start, man, but, hey, look at it. I made the move, man. I made the move, boy. Ooh, them things look good on there, too. Man, we this, this how we ride for right now, man. Old Tasmanian theme and everything. It just is what it is. You got to enjoy these cars while you build them. I keep telling people, people, the game so messed up. The uh, the car won't be like somebody wanted, man. They won't even ride it. Like I know people wouldn't even drive their car just cause it got an old Tasmanian devil theme on it. It fixed up from back in the day, or oh, it got the old old school uh, interior setup and all that. Even though the, the body's solid. It's a solid car. It's a good running car. I know people wouldn't dare put rims on there yet. Yes. Hey, that's why I dare to be different. Dare to be different, man. Y'all know how I get down by now. I don't care what nobody say. I don't care what nobody think. I don't care how they look at me in traffic. I'm riding. I'm look at you and smile. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to look at you and smile because I'm living. Man, I'm on a dream car 73. Don't just bought it a month ago and we already on them feet. So y'all see what I did, man. Y'all saw a thumbnail anyway, man. I put Dolo, put Dolo sixes on here. But I did it because I want to go ahead and have the car set up for the six, the ride height, everything. So that way, when I get the rims I'm gonna put on the car, car I'm gonna put these back on Dolo. I just I love the way they look on here now. Don't get me wrong, but my eyes just used to seeing them on Dolo. And the profile of tire. I run a thicker cut tire. It's a 25 series, but it's a thicker cut. I run that because I run Dolo on rims. That's why I got that tire. This this car right here, I'm going to run a smaller cut tire like a Lexani or something, which is 25 series, same exact size tire, but it's it's a lower cut. It just give you more clearance. So, uh, that's the plan, man. I got to I got to get up on there. I got to get up on there and show y'all everything. The suspension set up right now. Y'all know who did it. Lawless Street Car and Fabrication, man. Shout out to my boy Jesse and the whole crew and all of that, man. I really appreciate them guys. They put their work in. And let me show you what else we got. We got a new. I got to unlock it. I got to show you what else, too. I told y'all I did a carburetor. I ain't even looked at it. And boy, do it right better. I got to let y'all hit. I got to let y'all hit, man. The car was running bad the whole time, which I told y'all. A carburetor, man, a carburetor can affect your car so bad they don't put my hood, my hood release. Let me see. Look. Oh, hold on. Now. It ain't catching. 
I don't believe that dog come up out of y'all. I'm gonna, I am gotta see if I can pop the hood, man. Y'all hold on. All right, I got it, man. I just got to put, got to, it's a two hand, boy. You have to hold that thing, cause it try to pull, pull out. It might need a clip or some retaining clip back there to keep it in, in play. But, um, yeah, we got that. We got that, uh, hold on. Too much, y'all. Hold on. We got that Holly up there now. The Holly 600. And when I say runs a whole lot better, run a whole lot better, man. Whole lot better. I am not playing. Man, this thing here. Got a retaining spring seat. I don't even need that kick. This thing run 10 times better. Ain't no more of that sputtering. All that. Let me, uh, I gotta get me an air cleaner. I'm gonna go get an air cleaner tomorrow, man. They just protect the carburetor. But reach in here. Let y'all hear how it sound now. I said, I little thing run like a sewing machine, boy. Run like a sewing machine, man. Got a little exhaust leak up there. I just heard it. Of course you run good. Run like a sewing machine. I hear that exhaust leak. All I hear that exhaust leak now. I done heard it. All I can hear is that exhaust leak. That old N3, that old 350 run good, man. So look, we come together little by little, man. Remember, we're out there, we're hanging. We fixed that. We didn't have no sound, no music. We got new music all inside. We didn't have no rear view mirror. We got rear view mirror. We had no dome light cover. We got dome light cover now. Uh, new hood release. Remember the cable was broke. Uh, new head unit. I ain't have the cigarette lighter. I did a lot to that car already. I got that too. The knob. I got I to gotta pop that in. Replace that. I got the knob. For the lights. Now my next thing, since they got the hood release, it was my main thing, is to figure out why the wipers, why the wipers intermittent and just don't work all the time. So I gotta figure that out, the wipers, and then get back on the uh, get back on the the uh, heat, the heat and blower motor situation. Well, boy, I tell you what. People would be like, man, I wouldn't do that, isn't it? Hey, let me tell you something. As long with you, as long with it, you happy in your car and you enjoying that, that that joker, hey man, do your thing. Don't worry about these people. What's wrong with the game now? I ain't like that. I do what I want. I ain't following nobody. I don't care what nobody say. That's why I can move and I'm in my own lane. They'll how I move like I move. Look at that joke, man. Yeah. We used to, you know what funny though? I'm gonna tell y'all what's funny. Cause I ain't never understood it about fashion either. Back in the day, so and so were clean, right? But then all of a sudden, then how you know the world full of sheep and followers. Now listen to me. So look at the 70s, you had a certain fashion trend, right? You had a certain era. The 80s, you had a certain era. The 90s, early 2000s. Like I said, y'all know I do my skits with early 2000s be like and stuff. At that time, that stuff clean. Now, let's say early 2000s, the way we used to dress. We used to have the baggy, the, the baggy pants, long tees, and all that stuff. Now, I can understand you grow out of it, you know. But that don't mean you don't look at it like, oh, that clean. Or you might say, oh, that look silly. Because you done grew out of it. But how can that be clean back then? And it could be the way you think too. You know what you come up in as a younger. But then all of a sudden is it ain't it. Same thing with the car. The car, things were clean. Y'all remember that era? Everybody want to ride theme car, man. Everybody want to ride theme car. Some kind of thing. You killing the game, you had a thing. Now you got a thing they laugh at. You. Or back in the day when People weren't riding all them name brand real. But now you find some name brand, or not, I mean, when you find some, what they call off brand real, 
then hey, it's a problem. I don't understand these folks, man. It's a problem. If it's an all brand rim and it look good, what the problem? There were folk riding back in the day. Look at these look at them folk back in the game. That back in the day they were doing their thing. Snit off brand rim. Now you put some all brand rim, man, nah, that ain't it. Brother, you don't <laughs> you don't tell me what ain't it. That that how you got to think, man. You don't tell me what ain't it. So hey man. Like I told y'all before, y'all know how I get down. Somebody be talking about that paint, cause y'all know cosmetic stuff be the, the last of what I be worried about. But I pull up like that with that pressure. <laughs> that thing growling. Hey, you can't tell me nothing. <laughs> like, you can't tell me nothing, man. Oh, 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 sell tray. Oh, sell tray clean, boy. This new. This new went crazy. Then it ride good. Boy, it ride like a. Right like a a, a a new car. Them boy if I every time they mount one of my cars up, they do ride smooth. I don't think I know that it need alignment, but I know why it need alignment. Cause the bushings, the A on bushings up here, they wore out. So what we gonna do, we're gonna go ahead and get the QA1 uh A on. So I'm gonna go ahead and put them on there. I wasn't gonna do it this fast, but because the car needs it. I'm gonna do it cause I'm, I gotta do that to make it. They ain't gonna be able to line the car anyway. So I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. We're gonna put them on there. And then, uh, hey man, we finna ride. We finna ride and enjoy this joke. Cause I got a plan. I'm telling you, I ain't nothing. That's all I'm gonna do to the car right now. I'm doing a little knick knack stuff. I ain't nothing moving until Meach. <laughs> until Meach is how he's supposed to be. That's my number one player, Meach. That's my number one player. Meats come before everything and anything when it comes to the fleet. Meats come first. So, uh, I got to get meats on, um, get meats shaking and, and rattling, rolling, all that good stuff, man. So, you know, y'all know y'all see a glimpse of stuff like, look, hey, I've been moving. I've been moving, man. I dropped I drop this out of order. I dropped this video out of order just call um I'm anxious for y'all to see it and debut it. I've been want, I've been keeping it secret on what I'm doing, but I want y'all to see it. So, see the other vlogs. You probably gonna know already. I got vlogs coming behind all this stuff, but I dropped this one out of order, man. But we got it mounted up. Shout out Jesse, the whole Lawless team, man. Appreciate them, man. We're on the sixes now. We definitely finna be riding highway footage, rolling footage, coming soon, and all that. So yeah, appreciate y'all. Catch y'all later, BCG. We out.